Hey guys, in this video, we'll compare the Meizu M2 with the Lenovo Y P1M on the basis of internet speed and benchmarking tests. So, as you can see, both the devices are connected to the same Wi Fi network and both these are an Android 5.1 lollipop. So, let's start off with the internet speed test first. The score for the internet speed test is almost the same guys so let's move on to our next test that is the uh, Ninamark 2 so let's begin the test at the exact same time here so that we can also know which device completes the test first so um, this is the Ninamark 2 and both device completed the test at the exact same time the score for the Meizu M2 is 54.5 fps and that for the Lenovo yp one ms 50.2 FPS. So in this test, the Meizu is the clear winner. So let's move on to our next test. That is the N22 benchmarking test. And let's clear all the apps and begin the test at the exact same time. The Meizu M2 has a MediaTek 6735 processor clocked at 1.3 GHz, while the Lenovo yp one m has a MediaTek 6735P processor clocked at 1 GHz. Both the devices have 2 GB of RAM and 16 GB of onboard storage and both the devices have micro SD card slot expansion and both the devices support 5 inch HD 720p display so uh, both the devices must be using the exact same uh, processing power for the displays so this is a fair comparison I guess So uh, the Meizu M2 here is the first to finish off the N22 test. So the N22 score for the Meizu M2 is 31,224 and these are all the other scores you can pause and check them and the ranking is uh, 15th. So uh, let's do a quick little display multi point touch test and the Meizu M2 supports 10 point multi touch. So the Lenovo has finished its test and the score is uh, 23,555 for N22 benchmark and, and all the other scores and uh, the ranking is uh, 15th again I don't know why and the information given here and let's do a quick uh, display test and the Lenovo supports 5 point multi touch so even in the N22 test the Meizu is the clear winner so let's clear all the applications and let's move on to our next and final test the Geekbench 3 so let's start off the Geekbench 3 at the exact same time on both the devices and let's check the scores out and also check which device completes the test first So the Meizu is the first to finish off the Geekbench 3 test and the scores for single core is 616 and while that for multi core is 1667. So let's wait for the Lenovo to finish off its test and then we'll check the scores. So even the Lenovo has completed its test and the single core score is 484 and the multi core score is 1399. So even in this test the Meizu M2 is the clear winner and from the comparison video of ours we found out that the Meizu M2 totally destroys the Lenovo YP1M in benchmarking tests. So thanks guys, thanks for watching and do like, comment and share this video and guys do subscribe to my channel. Thank you so much. Goodbye. Take care.